Consumer Watchdog is calling for an investigation into the practices of Clearview AI, a facial recognition company accused of violating California privacy law. And now there are new reports that are highlighting the disproportionate impact the company's alleged practices are having on communities of color. That's right. IT reporter Stephanie Sierra is here with more. Stephanie. There's a technology out there that you may not know about, but there's a good chance they know you. And that's Clearview AI. A new report from Consumer Watchdog claims the facial recognition company scrapes images off the Internet, often from social media sites, then sells them to public agencies and potentially foreign companies to make a profit. In fact, it's virtually impossible to avoid being in that database. Consumer Watchdog's litigation director, Jerry Flanagan, calls it invasive and a violation of state law. California law makes it very clearly both illegal for Clearview to collect your image without your say-so, without your consent, as well as to sell that data or share it to others. He says a recent ACLU settlement barred Clearview from selling its product to private businesses, but adds there are no statewide restrictions on the company to sell its tech to government and law enforcement agencies in California. The CEO has made the point that they are selling broadly throughout the United States to law enforcement. The company advertises on its website it's advancing public safety. Adding its investigative platform allows law enforcement to rapidly generate leads to help identify suspects, witnesses, and victims to close cases faster. But numerous reports highlight concerns about inaccuracies targeting communities of color, including a recent study published in November by Georgetown University's Law Center, saying the tool is, quote, particularly prone to errors. Adding the real-world consequences of such errors include the investigation and arrest of an unknown number of innocent people and the deprivation of due process of many, many more. In fact, a MIT study found that the software incorrectly identified up to 35% of darker-skinned women. In a statement sent to the I-team, Clearview AI refutes that, saying, quote, Clearview AI's algorithm has been assessed by the National Institute of Standards and Technology, a U.S. government office, and found to be highly accurate across all demographics. There's also questions about the right to privacy with political rallies. Clearview AI told the I-team their technology has been used to identify Capitol rioters during the January 6th insurrection. Keep your lives off my body! But Flanagan argues... When you're in a public space exercising your First Amendment rights to protest or to associate with a political party, or you have the right to do so without unwarranted government surveillance. Now, Clearview AI criticizes a number of the concerns raised in Consumer Watchdog's report are mistaken conclusions of the law. But that hasn't stopped several California cities from adopting ordinances barring agencies from using its technology. And that's the case in both San Francisco and Oakland. Hmm.